I'm here at the Hollywood Highland Center. Today we are going to be witnessing a world record breaking event of the most people participating in a dance thriller. Come with me and let's see what this is about. In 2006, Inez Markel took a small idea and her love for dancing set the spark that would grow into a global event called Thrill the World. Just extremely excited to know that this was happening in, I don't even know yet, 60 to 80 places. As soon as that was done, I was like, there's got to be people around the world who want to do this dance. Yeah. I can teach it really well. So I made all the materials, put it online. Last year we had 1,700 people. This year, we'll see. I'm just counting the numbers right now. This small event started in Toronto and expanded across 91 cities and 12 countries in just two years, setting a new world record of the most dancers in one simultaneous event. It's a lot of fun and then I can pick up guys at the bar saying, I got my name in the Guinness Book of World Records. It's very exciting, anything you know to dress up like a zombie. She taught the dance herself and prepared the participants diligently through a series of rehearsals. The courtyard of Hollywood and Highland Center exploded with dancers in zombie costumes, the press, and nearby spectators as it set the stage for this year's Thrill the World 2008. Um, I think it's great. I think it's what makes LA LA. I love Halloween. It's my favorite holiday of all time. So I think this is awesome that a bunch of people got together to do this. Adam Savani, Moose from the recent movie Step Up 2, was a highlight of the event as he played the role of Michael Jackson in the famous music video. Daily Brewing columnist Janae Cohn experienced this thrill herself. How do you feel? I feel awesome. It was just a really exhilarating feeling to be around so many people all doing one dance at the same time. It's always been sort of my dream to be in one big synchronized dance group. I mean, just for fun. It's something that just never happens in real life. So just to have this and even an artificial setting feels like just an exhilarating feeling. The Guinness Book of World Records is ready for this year's new record of 3,738 dancers from all around the world. Well, I hope you enjoyed all of the Bruins. Reporting for Daily Bruin Television, I'm Michelle Kim. Ever, after.